Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how I set up my OBS Studios, how I get my gameplay display showing up, how I get my face on there, how I get my mic set up. Oh, this is going to be a jam-packed tutorial, so I hope you guys enjoy the video. Uh, what I want you to do first though, your very first thing, before we get started in this video, hit that like button. Alright, I need you to hit that like button. You have, you have a second of your life to give to me right now. You're already started watching this. Hit the like button, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell. Guys, it helps me out whenever you guys just push a few little buttons on your phone or click something with your mouse. It doesn't take you guys but a second. It doesn't affect you, but it helps me. So, if you guys could do that for me, that would be awesome. And we're going to get right into this video right after this. All right, guys, so what we have here is a blank screen. What an amazing screen it is, guys. So what I want to show you first is how I'm going to get a source onto this sucker. All right, guys, so see this magical thing right here? We have the never-ending screen of OBS. All right, so what I did to get this right here, I hit this plus button, okay? And then you go up here to display capture and you set it up. You hit create new and you set it up to whatever displays. I have multiple displays. So I set it up for that display. Hit OK and it takes you to this screen right here. So now you have some kind of display um, set ready to go. So what we're going to do now is we are going to get some things added on here. So I have an Elgato capture card. Uh, HD60S. It's in the description below. But I want to get that gameplay on here for you guys. So we're going to go video capture device. I'm going to call this sucker Elgato uh, HD60S. So I know which one I'm messing with. Create new. Alright, look at that. Bam! It is there, guys. Look how beautiful that is. What we're going to do now, okay? So you're going to go to where it says Elgato HD360 and you are going to transform it fit to screen so whenever we look at it now you can see my whole screen on what I'm doing it's beautiful alright so now we have gameplay okay so we're going to go back to this capture right here and now we want to add my face. You guys want to see my beautiful face, right? So, we're going to go back to another video capture device. Alright, we're going to call this guy Brio. And it's going to have game capture again. We're going to go down here to this Logitech Brio on the screen. And bam. So you click it right here. Go down to Logitech Brio. Can you guys see that sucker okay? So you're going to go Logitech Brio. Click that sucker. Hit. I like to configure them to make sure I'm zoomed out. My autofocus is on. Apply that good stuff. Alright, so now you have your beautiful face on here. Alright, so I like to put mine down in the bottom corner. Look guys, this is basic. This is all basics. And once you start getting into adding things like scenes, this can get a lot more complex and a lot cooler. So, we now have gameplay. Okay. And we have video. Alright, basic. Now look. This is what I came into having issues with when I first started, okay? I had everything like this on the bottom here. These three items right here. Okay, so you see, I can see everything. It says that I'm able to view it all. But, I can't see my camera. I couldn't figure out where my face was. It is a bring-to-front 
setup. So whatever you want in the background, you have to put towards the bottom. So if I want the display capture, I'm going to turn this off right here. The display capture, if I want what you're seeing right now, OBS Studio, to be underneath my camera. So that my camera's on top, I have to bring it down below my camera. Bam. Same thing with my gameplay, okay? So if my game right here, see I turned it on, you can't see my camera. My camera should be right there. So what we're going to do is I'm going to bring it down. Bam! You see my camera. Make sure that your background, whatever your main gameplay is, or whatever it is, is underneath on the bottom so that you can see everything. Let's move that. So you can see everything that you're doing. What the world is going on right there? So you can see everything that you're doing right here. Okay. So that's basics right there, guys. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into, because you want to get audio. You want to know, why can I not hear myself? Why can I not hear my game? So whenever you add the Elgato, it automatically should bring it on as a let's bring this right here let's put the Elgato in the background it brings it on right here into your soundbar okay all I gotta do is bring that volume up I don't probably don't have anything playing on the game right now let's see if I can get it to see here it lights up whenever I'm moving it all right so there's that you also have your desktop audio good to have use uh, use it with my Spotify stuff like that uh, if I'm watching a video on YouTube and I want to record it it's in there as well okay but you want your microphone you can see I have my microphone it is pinging right now you see that beautiful beautiful color so we are gonna go to settings oh it's so important let's make sure you can see the settings all right can you see settings yeah Alright, so you're going to go to settings. You're going to go to audio. In audio, you can set where your desktop audio is coming from. If you want a secondary desktop audio, which is, you know, that's good too. Um, and then you set your microphone. My microphone is a default, but I have a blue snowball. So you set that guy as your microphone. And now all you have to do is hit OK and bam you have a microphone you can see it it is all displayed on there ready to go for you so I've showed you basic basic stuff there's a lot of information packed into this video so you're able to put your gameplay up you're able to do your microphone you're able to show your face to people it's all ready to go and so now the next video that I'm going to show you guys and it should be coming out here in the next couple of days is going to be how to set up scenes and here is the awesome part of scenes okay so what I have here is stream elements is incorporated with OBS to make everything so much easier and there's so much integration that you can do to make your stream look amazing and the great thing about it all is it doesn't use as much computer processing it's all browser files so everything is set on a browser in the back end so that it doesn't just wear your computer out I actually had a motherboard fry and it took me six months to get a new motherboard and save up the money to get what I wanted to get so that I could be able to get back into making videos and streaming so but what you're gonna be able to do is stuff like this you're gonna be able to have your starting screens all this fun stuff ready to go with you you're gonna be able to have stuff like set up stingers like that have your main scenes your be right back scene will be ready to go for you so that you can get right into having all of your information there ready to go see that's my camera scene so that we can talk you can chat with me um, normally it's resized I don't know why it's sized like this but But that's that's the start of it man that's the start guys get yourself streaming get started and then when you're not streaming 
start working on your stream setup. How does it look? How is it all put together? Does it all flow well? We're going to get into that. We're going to dig into that a little bit more uh, in the next couple videos. But with that being said, guys, thank you for watching the video. If you made it this far, I'm going to give you five high fives. All right, you. that was for you. So with those high fives, guys, I'm out of here. Hit that like, subscribe button again. Guys, check out my Twitch. Um, I am live Tuesdays and Thursdays at 9 o'clock. Stop by, talk to me. Um, let's talk about streaming. Let's talk about video games. Let's talk about whatever you want to talk about. I, I'll answer everything to the best of my ability, and we'll just have fun chatting and hanging out. And with that being said, guys, um, I'm out. Peace.